the CJ2 squat to press. You can start from the ground, or like I have it here, you can start with the, uh, you know, with the uh, barbell resting on the Renegade Stand Varsity. Okay, so the squat to press pretty much is a is a is a highly complex movement, but it's pretty intuitive. It's based on the natural movement of you know squatting and throwing uh, an object, let's say. Okay, so I'm going to start here, lift, and I'm going to get in my um, athletic stance, but notice that I am hip width apart on the ball of my feet. Okay, so once I get, I find my 90, guys, all you got to do is squat by flexing the knee. Don't break at the hip, okay, right here. Yeah. And then from here, up and press with a slight lean forward, okay. Bring it down, okay, and up, okay. So, again, it's super uh, easy to learn. It, uh, you know, the only constraint or limitation might be the, the load. If it's too heavy for you, just get, you know, eliminate uh, load or use a lighter barbell. Okay, right here. Actually, at Pure Motion, we have the, uh, the Pure Bar, which is about uh, 15, 18 pounds, but there's all the barbells out there if you want to use it. Okay, the common mistake here is to maybe come too far forward. And you notice that the moment you, you try to squat, you do this at pel anterior pelvic tilt, and you start coming down, it just doesn't look right. And the opposite is true. You try to go too far back, okay? And then when you squat here, you see I'm breaking at the hip, it just doesn't feel right, okay? There's only one way to do it. It's 90 right here, okay? And see, come all the way down and press, all right? So again, there's not much to go over this movement because it's pretty natural. Okay, the CJ2 squat to press.